Hey y'all, how y'all doing today? Um, I hope y'all can hear me. My husband and my children are having a uh, movie night, so they got the surround sound and all that stuff on. I just wanted to come in right quick on this really cold um, Sunday afternoon and uh, just say hey. Hey, Corey. And um, y'all, I'm in the kitchen cooking. I'm not cooking anything real heavy. Stop, boy! It's chopping to pull my lemonade down. I'm not laughing with you, little midget. You hear? But anyway, my husband grilled some chicken today, and I'm getting ready to make a small pot of baked beans. I'm going to make my tuna macaroni salad. I'm making homemade lemonade. And I do have a roast in the oven. The roast will probably be for later on. Because I know how we like to eat. And uh, that chicken will be gone in no time. So the roast. And I'm going to put some potatoes and carrots in. And make some rice. So we got two meals going today. Which that will carry over till tomorrow. And um, tomorrow myself. I don't know about nobody else. But I want me a barbecue beef sandwich tomorrow. So I'm going to take the roast out of the gravy and I'll you know shred it up in pieces and um, mix it with some barbecue sauce and simmer it for about five or ten minutes on the stove and then put it on me some bread yeah that's gonna be the bomb I don't care I'm, and I'm waiting on that one for tomorrow but anyway I got my chicken left over from last night y'all see those are the pieces that I have left so I'm getting ready to wrap that up I just got through eating a couple of pieces because I didn't eat anything today, y'all. It's wrong. I'm wrong on so many levels, knowing that I have to eat. But anyway, my daughter's making a chocolate cake. She's already got two layers done. And I got two more in the oven along with my roast. And you know, sense of me showing you because I don't have a light in my oven. But got my little small pan of beans on. And that's my elbows. Well, my tuna macaroni salad and we stir it up so it won't stick but y'all I'm going to show y'all and I don't know if anybody needs it but I don't I know a lot of people do but I can't stand regular pork and beans I really cannot oh my gosh you want me to heave put some regular pork and beans on my plate mm -mm. I can't hardly stand it this is what I use Bush original baked beans. Yes. Now, even with that, I add a few things to it to make baked beans for myself. So I'm going to show y'all what I use to make my baked beans. I'm going to try to do this really quick because y'all know I'm long-winded. And, um, and I'm not prepared as usual. getting stuff all out the cabinets one last ingredient and it would be that I can't doggone reach it Let me see if I son are you tripping today huh I don't know what it is with my baby and not wanting to wear clothes but this dude will not wear clothes at all yeah, you gonna, I'm going to cook you some baked beans in a minute. Darian, come here, please. I got to get Big Boy to come get it with his tall self. You give me that ketchup from up there, please. I keep saying every time I go to the store, I'm going to buy me a step stool. I ain't bought it yet. Thank you. Take, um, he see, he see these baked beans. You know he love baked beans. Okay, guys. So this is what I use to make my baked beans. I put a little ketchup, put about a fourth a cup of ketchup, okay, put a couple of tablespoons of mustard, okay. 
going to live about a fourth a cup of syrup. And I use Aunt Jemima's butter-rich syrup. And I'm going to put a little bit of Kraft barbecue sauce. Okay, so let me get this open. So you can see exactly how much I pour in. So about two tablespoons. And this is just for one can, y'all. So, you know, you can, you have to, you know, add a little bit as you go. I can't give you a direct, a direct measurement because, you know, everybody likes things differently. And I'm going to add about a cup of, of sugar. And I know that's a lot of sugar, but it will dissolve. So, let me get a spoon. Or a whisk. I think I'll use a whisk. And I'm going to stir this all together. And I hope y'all can see it because my light in this kitchen is not really good. But stir that all up, and there we go. That is it. Put it on and let it simmer for a little while, and we're good to go. Now, next on my menu is my um, I'm gonna make some lemonade. And on this side of the kitchen, it really is dark, so I might have to move over. Yes, it's junked up, but that's all right. It's my kitchen, and I I do believe in cleaning. And I'm going to clean this bad boy because I can't stand a kitchen with a lot of crap going on. Mm -mm. I can't stand it. Okay. So. Alright. So what I used was um, lemon juice from Concentrate. Okay, and this is a 32 ounce bottle. I have, um, I use two of these, and I don't know if you can see it, but let me see. I cut up a lemon and I put it down in there. Now, the only thing that's in this jug right now is my lemon juice and a whole lemon. I'm gonna add some sugar. And it's going to be about, probably about three cups of sugar. Because this is going to be a big, big um, picture of uh, lemonade. And I'm going to add water, of course. So I'm going to take this to the sink. And I can't give you a direct measurement on how much water to add because it depends on what size pitcher you have. Hold on, y'all. This is a crazy video, boy. I had it all the way in the dark. So I'm going to feel it. more than halfway full and I'll show y'all in a minute okay oh shoot this thing heavy so this is what I got you see it's more than halfway full
shake it up. So what I'm gonna do is use my um, spatula to stir it up. Now, I'm going to say this. This is not for anybody that have diabetes, um, any kind of problems where you have to, or if you want to diet, because that sugar that's in there is, baby, is, yeah. And um, the baked beans, um, you can make them, but you can cut back on the sugar. You add as much as you want. You don't have to add the syrup, or you could just add brown sugar. Either way it go, you're good to go. Now, I'm going to let that sit, put the lid on it. I turn my baked beans down. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to drain my noodles for, my, for the macaroni salad, a tuna macaroni salad. And um, I'll be back. Um, I'll see y'all in a few. Bye, sugar.